Oh shit. Oh, she better not fucking run me over, bitch. Okay, good. What's going on, guys? Connor Thrifts, episode 13. I don't know how to make that. In... <laughs> First stop is Goodwill. Then we're going to Thrift Sense. Then we're going to my friend's store way back when, located in Margate, Florida. Lacked up the Black Beauty. Going to Goodwill Superstore. <sighs> I can just tell it's gonna be a good day. It just feels like a good day. Very beautiful. Going to Goodwill, let's do it. Okay, so the only thing I found was this awesome Sandlot jersey, like the movie Sandlot. I think it's really awesome. I think it was custom made, but I still love it. I literally have a Sandlot button on my backpack. Five bucks, definitely a steal. Okay, I just got out of Value Pond. He always hooks it up. So for $4 total, I got Skate 2, NBA 2K14 disc only, and then the Sims 3 disc only right there. Paid four bucks. I'm gonna trade in the GameStop. The discs are a little bit scratched up, so I'm gonna get a little bit money taken off, but I'll still get around like $15 total for $4 spent. Look at the snapback. Oh my god, so sexy. Look at those hummingbirds. Green hummingbird. Red and purple headed. I just love it. So awesome. I'm gonna wear it forever. Next stop is Way Back When Antique Store right here. Very cool place. Very cool place. He gives really good deals. Sells video games, electronics, you name it. He's got old stuff, antiques. Joey right there. All right, guys. We're going to a few different thrift stores. My buddy Joey, he owns uh, Way Back When, Margate Boulevard. Go check it out, very good store. Sells like antiques, video games, toys, memorabilia, movie stuff, awesome store. Go check it out, guys. Next stop, Salvation Army with Joey. What, auction? auction cars, October 10th, oh, I'm going to Disney World that day. Oh, you suck. <laughs> Found these hyper fuses. I think they're called no hyper dunks. My bad. Uh, these are $1.99, but it looks like a dog chewed them up. I'm debating whether to buy for two dollars or not. Like I could probably sell one shoe. <laughs> Next stop, Family Thrift in Oakland Park. We in the hood though. Like this is straight hoodness right here. They could afford accordion shutters though. If you're under 18 years old, you must be accompanied by an adult. So far I'm winning at the hunt. I found this New York Giants hat for a dollar and this awesome museum head replica for seven dollars. This piece sells for around 60 to 80 bucks online. Any opinions on that? What are you looking up? A placemat for eating? Are you that hungry? I want to show you this pair of shoes down here. It's crazy how worn they are. Look at that, it's insane. All the way down to the ball, it's disgusting. The drag is huge. I don't see anything good here. Just some Nike high tops. These are huge, what size are these? 16, holy shit. Literally the most confused person in the world right now when it comes to shoes, I have no clue what these are. These are either fake Bobo shoes or like some rare ass shoes. They're actually not that yellow at the bottom, like they're not that bad. Hopefully they're like not foo-foo. So sadly they're asking too much for these, I can't pick them up for 30 bucks. If they were $10 or 15, I'd get them. They only sell for like 50, 60 dollars. Not worth it in my opinion. I never know like what to buy with like these type of mugs and stuff like that for you What I'm the what the fuck is that? How much is that two bucks two bucks? Oh my it's super steel It's gonna look awesome in our store. I know a girl named Giovanna that would like this for ten bucks But it's not worth buying to resell pretty cool though. He definitely scored on the Batman mask. That thing's awesome This is the best deal of the day Grand Theft Auto 5 for three dollars Mario Kart for 99 cents Tecmo Super Bowl for 99 cents Pokemon snap for 2 dollars very happy with today's finds All right, so we just got out of Goodwill over here. Joey spotted think thrift. He's like, what is that? I'm like, that's KFC and he's like no that think thrift. It's right next to save a lot and family dollar so we're at this new thrift store i've never been to and they got a holy hat section look how many hats they have over here all these hats are so expensive 15 bucks is still expensive for a ps1 oh look at this this is cool super joystick and power gun look at the ghetto n64 controller that's so funny they want 15 bucks for this ghetto ass shit this is definitely the score of the day one dollar 1976 conca truck we're watching finding nemo we found this yesterday he, he got a little mannequin for it or a womankin this thing is awesome it goes for like 200 bucks is Matt. Okay, these are all the hats I got for a dollar a piece. Mickey, Florida Marlins, Miami Dolphins. They're all vintage, they're very nice. New York Giants, Florida Panthers. They're all snapbacks too. 1997 champion, New York Jets. Buffalo Bills, this is probably my favorite one. I like how that looks on the side like that. Jacksonville Jaguars. And then this last one is the New York Giants with a pin. Pretty cool, those were a dollar a piece. Definitely gonna make some money on these, at least $10 a piece at the lowest. Joey got some really good stuff too. He's rearranging his so for seven dollars, you got this Venom zip-up hoodie. She looks like a unicorn. I hate it because you can't breathe. Seven bucks, 
easy $50 flip on eBay. These Asics, I never buy these kind of shoes, but they look pretty cool. I might get them for myself. They're only 10 bucks. Look them up. They're not worth that much, but personally, I just kind of like them. They look funky and like weird. They kind of remind me of like a ghetto version of like the 350 Boost. Okay, so the only find of the day so far is this robot from 1984. It's not worth that much money, but it's only three bucks. Uh, it sells for like 15, 25 bucks. Jay's on my feet. so sad these aren't my size these are so fucking sick size 7 why oh my god these are so nasty okay so i looked them up and they're called lebron 7 christmases they're a little bit beat up but i don't care they're still beautiful should be able to get an easy 50 bucks out of them scoring at the thrift store thank you guys so much for watching this video make sure you guys slap that thumbs up button become a subscriber and have a nice day my favorite pickups of this video is definitely those vintage hats followed by those lebron 7 christmases i really wish they were my size size 13 thank you guys again so much for watching this video have a nice day. Peace out, guys. Bye-bye. Erectile dysfunction is bad, but leaving a like on the video isn't. Whether you're hard or soft, make sure to slap that like button and subscribe while you're at it.